this 2003 Jaguar X-Type I think needs to be seen to be appreciated. It's an absolutely beautiful condition. It's got two keys, it's got a very nice set of Michelin tyres and it's the two and a half litre V6 with all wheel drive. Comes in this beautiful champagne colour with cream leather interior and it does have navigation. It's also got the five speed gearbox and drives beautifully. Someone's really looked after it. Generally when you see a car like this and it's got you know, a nice set of Michelin or Continental tyres, um, generally you can tell someone, someone's looked after the car, haven't just gone and bought Chinese tyres for 60 or $70, they've done the right thing. The colour is absolutely beautiful. It's got a spare wheel in the back here. Oh, that's, it's just great that Jaguar would do things like that properly. It's got a full size spare with a Pirelli tyre on it. Unlike other manufacturers which just give you, give you a car with some run flat tyres or a space saver spare. It's also got parking sensors. The cream leather interior is in beautiful condition. You know, and the fact that you can buy one of these Jaguar X-Types for under $15,000 is, is remarkable. They're safe, economical, reliable, and they just look a million bucks. Whether it's an X-Type, an S-Type, or an XJ, they do it properly. You've got plenty of timber. Timber everywhere, got a beautiful walnut dash. Including on the doors, you've got some timber there as well. It doesn't have a sunroof, but it does give you a lot more headroom, not having a sunroof. I can't see any dents or scratches on this car whatsoever. It's been garaged. It really is beautiful. And as I said, I think really it needs to be seen <clears throat> and driven to be appreciated. The other good thing about buying a car in this price range, if you bought it for say $14,000, and you had it for two or three years and you really looked after it, serviced it properly, and you weren't doing a great deal of, of case, it's going to hold its value. I mean, why would you buy a Hyundai or a, you know, a Chinese car for the same sort of money, which at the end of it is going to be worth $500 when you can buy a car like this? And if they're looked after, they are very reliable. A lot of people are a bit scared of Jaguars and their, you know, because friends tell them that you know, they're expensive or they have issues, but you know, they're a very different car to what they were in the 60s, 70s and 80s. You know, when the X300 came out in around 1994, 95, they, it really was a game changer. You know, they were reliable, they looked fantastic, um, and they're very desirable today. To buy a good Jaguar XJ6, you'd be spending up to $20,000. And we have seen them with 300 and even 400,000 kilometres. And if you, if you are interested in buying a Jaguar, and you're a little bit worried about maintenance and things, why don't you actually talk to someone who owns one? So I think you'll be pleasantly surprised. And I think it's very clever having the all-wheel drive system coupled with the 2.5 litre V6. Personally, I would much rather buy a 2003 or a 2004 Jaguar X-Type 2.5 all-wheel drive than an 05, 06, you know, 07, 2.1 front-wheel drive. I think they're just a much better car. Uh, so much so that the last two and a half litre we had, um, we had someone trade in a much newer 2.1 litre, and they actually traded it on an older 2.5 just like this one because they wanted the extra power and uh, the better handling on the road. And again, that's someone who's had a Jaguar X-Type, they've had a very nice experience and they've bought another one. So it's very nice to see. But if you have any questions about this car, please give us a call. I'd be more than happy to answer any questions you may have. But if you are looking for a Jaguar, 
under $15,000 or if you have been looking at Jaguar X-Types, please come have a look at this car. You're certainly not going to be disappointed. There is just one dent on the back here, which um, we'll get our dent specialist to have a look at. But that's the only dent I can see on this car. I did miss that before when I was going around. But uh, I'm very, very impressed by this vehicle. Thanks so much for taking the time to watch this video and we look forward to hearing from you.